waiting for Hbox, so he'll be in there shortly as well. Let's see, sauce. Oh, from Oregon. Okay, very nice. DK player. DK versus uh, Hbox, so that should be fun. Right, you're gonna see Hbox get stomped, or we should watch uh, Hbox like maybe get some shield pokes. Good uh, combo game. But I don't know. Are we live? Yeah, we're live. Oh. Okay. What's up, everybody? Yeah, we have Saw Step versus Hbox. So, no surprise where we're starting, of course, Smashville. Or, what is this, Pokemon Stadium? New Smashville. I, I actually started calling it Starter Stadium, actually. Star Stadium, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what I started calling it. Oh, I, I was gonna be clean if he actually got that, but unfortunately he woke up. I was scared for Hbox's life, man. Every time I see DK just mash a button off stage, you'd be surprised with how much they get away with it. Oh? <laughs> yep. Well, like a baby. Like a baby. Sink to sleep combo. Just resting right on top of Sauced Up. Hbox feels it today, man. I'm telling you, that that melee patch they got. I'm mean, being he... a little honest. I'm surprised he's uh playing ultimate today. You know, especially with all that melee news that was coming out, how, how they got rollback netcode rolling. Personal goal, man. I I think that's what it's about. Like his personal goal is like you know, I, I want to win an online tournament, more online tournaments, or an online tournament. I don't know. I don't know if he's won one yet, so I can't tell you for sure. Last time I checked, he hadn't. But yeah, personal goal. There's nothing wrong with that. God, that pound hitbox lingers so long. Like even after uh, Jigglypuff has stopped her momentum forward, just having the fist out that lingers, <laughs> and then you can combo off off that uh, late hit. Yeah, I think that's like one of the scariest. Like it's definitely. Ooh, I was gonna say, it's definitely like a noob killer. Like if you don't know how to re how to definitely fight. Pound, you will take a big loss against it. But also Pound, like as you see, it has really good shield damage too. And that's what kind of makes Pound a really good move. Yeah, right. For Jigs at least. That's a good move from Saw Step. It's gonna cover oh. a good amount of options and the platform. But Saw Step going to be able to make it back. Still, even after the footstool, going to recover. Yeah, Hbox, I think he's lucky to try to come back on stage more towards center. He doesn't run a reset at the ledge. Really good stuff. I was really scared for that roll out, but I mean, <laughs> he's, he's out there. He's still alive. Cargo throw, this will kill, yeah. Jigs, still top five light character of the game. Nice, good wave land on the stage. He's, I was going to say, at that point, the way that he's consistently showing his back, it's a soft step. It's, he's letting it know, you know what, if you come any closer, if you miss space, if you come in too hot, there's a back air. And I think that wave line was a really good way to kind of show that off a little bit. Yeah, soft step even going for a delay right there, using his oh. up B just to escape on three boxes traps. Nice. He backs off. I think at that point, I'm like, he kind of knows. I don't want to have to fight DK2 that much at close range. Nice down there. Oh no, this could be a pretty big one for Soul Step. 54%. That's still enough. That's not a lot. Like one hit right now will definitely kill JX, especially if it's a really good Dong Punch or a Smash Attack. Yeah, don't forget about the pseudo uh, Ding Dong that's still available on this stage. Yeah. That's why I'm surprised. Like, oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. I think that's up to Soul Step to actually start realizing, like, if Hbox is showing me his back, there are one of three things is going to happen. A back air, a roll read, or a get up read. Yeah, got to watch out with these rollouts too. You know, like Hbox likes to put a lot of pressure on the rollout, but his shield did not break. Wow. <laughs> oh, dude, that that was that was a teeth clencher. Oh man, that yeah, you're right. The shield did not break. 
I'm sorry, Sauce Step. Take the take the loss here. H box with game one. Good stuff to H box. I think he's. I think. I honestly think like each week he's getting better and better. And I think this week so far he's definitely shown it. Like it's the first match of the day, granted, but still, it's it's shown. I've seen, some, I've noticed some improvement here. I've definitely noticed some improvement. Um, you can. Oh, sorry. What was that? Sorry, I'm looking at the chat. Oh. Someone's like, "Is there somewhere I can look at bracket?" And I'm like, "Well, yes, there is. I'm just smash the GG forward slash MSMO." Oh, good pound. Good pound to Nair. Gets the throw. That's a lot of. That's already a lot of momentum here for Hbox. Plus, he already put Sawstep off the stage. Up to and up to uh, death. Okay. I'll tell you, mate. Death. Something happened, man. Maybe Hbox actually buffed himself through some kind of weird net play by by melee being updated with better <laughs> with rollback net code. You, you never know, man. That's probably the power up. CH box swinging at Salsta, continues throughout airs, pounds, or you're trying to get these delayed hit from forward airs. Honestly, just trying to get more extra credit before a huge hit from Salsta will clean out that stock. Okay, that's good. Into pound. I think that might have been a misinput. I think he might have gone for a different option there, and that's okay. He's still alive for it. 45%. Puff could still survive at these, at these percents, so he's doing so far so good. Really good on downer and the way that he was looking to cross up because if he doesn't cross up, it's not going to be that safe. Reads the option there with the back air. I mean, good stuff to H-Box. You got all those jumps, right? You're going to have to use them to kill an opponent at some point. Yeah, not to mention that Sauce Step um, committed to using his second jumps coming out of the bubble zone. So at that point, majority of the resources for Sauce Step have already been expended. H-Box uh, just had to throw out any much pressure uh, and Sauce Step had to deal with it. Yeah. Up there. Okay, he's looking for. He I was gonna say at this point he's looking for a backer. If I were a soft step, okay, yeah, fifty-six percent. That's even game. That's the scariest part here for H box. Is he kind of has to keep this momentum going as much as possible and not let soft step land like that, or he can get like a dog punch. Because he knows, like he wanted H box saw him when he had him at the corner. If he, if it were any other day, right, H box would have put in more pressure, but. He was safe away. Yeah, but look at the space that Hbox continues to to keep between Sawstep and himself. He's always like weaving in and out of the, the danger zone from Sawstep. He's he'll weave in and then he'll drift back with Nair. So he'll still have a threat. Um, and Sawstep drops shield, then you know, he'll get the he'll get the hit and he's able to convert. But Sawstep with a clutch up smash, it's gonna even up the score. I don't like it, but you know what? Good on Sauce Step to still fight himself to get back on the stage. Even though up special for GK isn't as good as it used to be compared to previous games, especially Smash 4, it's still disruptive. Like, it's still got some spacing to it. So with Puff, like, it, you could see, like, he really wanted to nair DK, and even then he didn't get that much of a strong hit from there. So I have to give it a Sauce Step. He still fought for that, especially he fought for his right to be back on stage. Yeah, yeah. Not only did he like fought for it, he he earned it. Yeah. And then he clapped Hbox into the sky. <laughs> I hate to see it. <laughs> That's just me personally, man. What the the clap? DK winning. This is <laughs> DK winning. I hate to see it. Uh, he earned it. Like, like you can't even be mad. He earned it. He. He got back on stage. In my book, man, DK never earns it. <laughs> he don't. He don't deserve nothing. But that's just me. That's my book, man. But don't let my book be the the finite view. It, yeah, definitely don't let that book be the finite view. Yeah. Don't 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 let you know. Vance, Vance just don't like DK. That's just how it is, man. Too many year Too many years of my life being tortured by JMX.
Let's see, so it looks like are they really going to Carlos? I think Carlos was the pick. I guess. Uh cap your cap your stage. I I I think I think it's good for HBox to probably go to Carlos, but I would have never allowed Sauce to go back to PS2. Uh, just because like I tell people like too many people gentlemen to PS2 without understanding the repercussions of being on PS2 and the advantage your opponent can have over you. Especially any of the um Mario-esque characters like DK, Mario, Luigi. Like you don't you don't want to go to PS2 against any character within the Mario set of games. Yeah, I honestly don't think like PS2 is actually that balanced, but I mean that's just my opinion. Okay, getting us started with the down B, using the armor, able to clip through H-Box to make it back to the ledge. Very good use of specials from from uh Swast Soft Step. I the MS, and I keep thinking I might say MS Paint, but it's MS Sauce. Oh, and now, now, see, this is what we're starting to see from Sauce Step. A little bit of a taste of his own medicine. He knows how he knows how solid DK backer still is. Oh, nice. He wanted to react to a roll or a get up option. Really good from H Box. Out there for probably the clutch kill at the F stage, but Sauce Step still survives. Back air to do it, and that'll do it. Yeah, 92% H Box. If you can hold on to this and maybe get a grab here, and put it put it at least fifty percent. Let's be real. Unless unless Hbox takes another stock, the percent doesn't matter. Yeah. But there's the cleanup from Saw Step. Only putting twenty two easily just make that up. See Hbox, you know he start he's continuing his game plan. I like that he isn't adjusting. Um, for the most part, it's been working in his favor outside of like a few interactions, but let's be real, that's all DK really needs. He only needs a few, to win a few interactions to either even it up or win the game. That was good, that was good, that was good. And think... unfortunately, that's gonna get him killed! <laughs> yep. Unfortunate. I mean, for HBox, he can definitely bring this back. It's just one aerial away. It's how he gets it, and how cautious he's gonna have to be around with DK with Rage. DK with rage, fully wound up. Hate to see it. this is like this is possibly the worst situation, but great up B out of shield. Did he did he jump cancel that? Uh, he did! I feel like he did, yeah. Okay, so Hbox swinging back, getting rid of all that rage, then angry uh, DK is gone. Yeah. 71% still. This is a dead puff. Good. Like this is actually a dead puff. Like it literally saw step. Probably sneezes on the C stick and, not, and Puff might actually die. Yeah, interesting enough, we've been seeing a few kills from Smash Attacks, which we typically don't see unless it's like a Hail Mary attack. Wow. He got him. He got him. Let's go, Clutch Box. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dang. I was about it. to deny it, but he died. Dang.